Hi, Diana Alexander here with another San Bernardino County COVID-19 news update. I'm happy to have with me today Mr. Michael Stoffel. He's a preeminent real estate agent here in the Inland Empire, and he's going to share with you tips on how you can remain COVID compliant while doing your real estate business. Welcome, Michael. Thank you for having me. First off, I want to make sure everyone knows that homes are selling every day during this pandemic. We're required to have all persons who enter a home sign a pandemic entry form provided to us by the California Association of Realtors that explains in detail the rules and risks associated with looking at homes. We're also required to have these forms posted in the home explaining the rules. Some sellers will have additional rules, such as wearing gloves or booties that can be listed online or in showing instructions given to other agents. I personally always have in my car and provide to my clients when needed masks as they're required, as well as hand sanitizer and the optional gloves. Some sellers require and provide booties when entering a home or require shoe removal at the door. I also instruct buyers not to open doors, drawers, windows, and that I will do it for them with gloves on. After a showing, I can re-sanitize any areas that may have been touched, and I also encourage all sellers to sanitize after showings as well. Michael, can you tell us what precautions you take before, during, and after showing homes? When dealing with buyers, we try whenever possible to make sure our clients can view homes first online with 3D tours or virtual showings. This could be much as myself going to take a video or using FaceTime with clients while at a home to help narrow down their favorite properties to see in person. The majority of buyers discover my listings via online marketing where they have links to videos, pictures, school and neighborhood info, and much more. Even before COVID-19, flyers were not really used often. When a buyer calls on my sign, I'm able to send them a link to the home as well as a digital business card. Michael, can you also give us some tips on alternatives that you can use to putting out flyers and marketing materials and brochures? Yes, please be aware of the comfort zone of each client and offer them what they need to feel safe and confident. For the agent's benefit, make sure the buyers are both financially and emotionally qualified and educate the buyers on the value of doing a Zoom session so together you can research homes and neighborhoods online before running out to look at them. I believe if you follow the best practices released by the California Association of Realtors and your local and state guidelines, as well as knowing the comfort level of your clients and adapting to them, you'll be just fine. Thank you so much, Michael. This has been awesome. Not only have you given valuable tips for those in the real estate business, but I think these are things that people can apply in any business in our county. Thank you so much for being with us. This has been another San Bernardino COVID-19 news update. Until next time, please take care and stay safe.